Hey y'all, Jeff Martin here. The Carport Motor Company, 929 Main Street, Blackshear, Georgia. Y'all, Harper Lee showed you a dually, a Ford F-350 with a V-10. that's only got 27,000 miles on it. I mean, that 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 is the buy on the lot. I'm telling you, that's the buy, but she showed you that last week. I wanna show you a 2003 Ram 3500. Y'all, this thing's a work truck. This thing's a beast, baby. I mean, it's got that that turbo diesel in it. I mean, she growls when she cranks. She gets bad. She's bad, y'all. I mean, look at it real quick. You still got this stuff? Um, everything's nice. I like how it's got fog lights down here. I mean, that's going to help you, you know, be able to boom, be able to see those deer just before they run into your grill. Just letting you know that, okay? But deer, they're, they're stupid animals, aren't they, Jeff? Pretty they're, stupid. They're crazy. I mean, they run into the truck. But either way, but nonetheless, the fog lights are always the bonus, all right? Well, that thing growls, doesn't it? All right, so look over here. Look how much tread is on these tires. You just can't beat it. Good old, f look, look, I'm burying my fingertip in it. Look, my, you don't even see my fingernail. I mean, that thing is a good, real good tread. Real, real good tread on this thing. Talk about a crew crack crew cab with leather seats. So you got a leather interior, okay? Yes, indeed. Yes, indeed. And then here in the back. Get on it, baby! All right, so now look at this. This is why this sucker's a work truck. I don't know how big that fuel tank is, but I'm gonna guess 50 gallons. I'm gonna take a shot at it and say it's 50 gallons. Y'all, it may be 100 gallons, but I mean, that's a dang big fuel tank right back here in the back. It's a work truck. This thing's meant to be out there taking care of business, earning you some money out of this truck. And we got it on a deal around here at the Carport Motor Company. But come over here, look at this. Inside the bed of the truck, we've got the connect the the, uh, the track there for you to be able to put your fifth wheel. All right, so you can put your fifth wheel in there. We got the ball in the metal for you to be able to do your gooseneck. Okay, put your coupler down there in that thing. I mean, this thing is all set up for work, 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 all day long. All right, um, got a little crack right back here on the third light. That's how it rolls. But the other third light up there is pretty good. All right, so that's aftermarket stuff right there. Got your big old heavy hitch back here. You can tow them three different ways with this truck. You can do a ball, you can do a fifth wheel, and you can do a bumper pull. I mean, it's awesome. The sucker's awesome. All right, so yeah, some minor blemishes. It's a work truck, y'all. Minor blemishes, a little, little scratchy, scratchy. But otherwise, I mean, the panels are not in and out. I mean, everything's good. Your seats aren't torn apart and ripped. All right, how many miles on this thing, Jeff? It was 203, I think. Two, uh, here, right here. It is. There you go. 203. 203. All right, let's hop in this thing. Let's, let's, let's crank this beast. Cummins Turbo Diesel. Woo! And, listen here. It's got, it's got um, tinted windows. It's got a little transition strip over there for the tent. I mean, it's pretty slick, all right? Power everything. Got your cruise control up here, all right? So that's really handy dandy. And of course, it's got a decent stereo. It's all stock, okay? All stock, nice little area to be able to, to tow and go, or store and go, rather. Um, yeah, this thing, that doesn't just release. You may have to, did it, did, it, did it earlier? I don't know. Okay, there it is, right there, boom. There's your cup holders, you're good to go. Okay, all right, she got, she got a little life that's been lived in her, you know? Um, little, uh, gotta let you know, there's a little crack in the dash, right? Right there. And then another one just a little, little ways up there. The two small cracks. I should refrain from saying too small. We do have other cracks that are up here in the dash. But I mean, y'all, seriously, it's not bad. It's 2003 with 203,000 miles on it. My finger! Okay, here we go. All right. Yep. And I'm gonna show y'all. Hey, wait, there's no lights. I wanna make sure you see this. On the dash, there are, other than now a fuel light just came on, but other than that, there are no lights on this beast. On this wonderful, gorgeous beast, okay? Okay, here we go. All right, so let's, let's get this again. All right. So, um, 
It's got the little uh, onboard computer up here to give you your fuel mileage. Right now it's tested out at 11. Um, but I mean, I, I could, you know, that's probably just goosing or whatever else. But you got all the, here, reset right there, boop, okay. So um, I'm fixing to get on this thing, so that ain't gonna be too pretty. But either way, nice, uh, you, all your little map lights work, everything's good. It's pretty nice, I mean, seriously, for what it is. All right, let's, let's, let's get this thing out here. For what it is, it's all that and more, that's what it is. Hachi Tachi Turbo Diesel. She doesn't skip, she doesn't hitch. She's got all the giddy up she's supposed to have. And she's got that extra gas tank, it's fuel tank that's in the back. I mean, now y'all, that's for farm, that's for farm work, you know what I'm saying? Now it's supposed to be putting your highway diesel in that thing. So it's to be all that farm work, all right? But nonetheless, just letting you know, that's how it rolls. Um, either way, good, uh, good traction, good steering. She doesn't jump, go back and forth or anything else like that. I mean, everything's great. And in terms of uh, AC, let me try that out here. It's an AC blower. Come on now. It's coming alive. I'm starting to feel that cool breeze. You know, y'all, it's February. Towards the end of February here, we're in the uh, mid 70s. So you you uh, get your air conditioner running in February, all right? Yeah, it's blowing good and cold now. That's how it rolls, that's how it rolls. And then, um, of course, your heat is gonna work. Oh, I got a car coming. This is a big mo digger. You know, I mean, you don't wanna be playing around sitting there warning me and telling me I'm not supposed to be back in the stop sign. All right, so, um, let's see here, switch over. Oh yeah, this is great. Yep, good heat, good heat. So you're, everything's good there. Let's look at the radio. I'm gonna tell you the speakers are shot. Pull up on your. She say that I got a ruler deal. Not all of her shot. I really win that ruler shot. Now I don't really get no by who I hit. Yeah yo, she get jiggy with me. She that jiggy with me. Jiggy jiggy with it. I'm mad max. You know I got jiggy with me. Keep a mad. It may get graphic in a minute, okay? So either way, uh, but either way, uh, the, the stereo does real work. It does have your cassette, cassette player. So you put your cassette in there, and you put your DVD in there, and um, man, it doesn't even have the bass turned up. How do you not have the bass turned up? Oh, I see why. Alright, so, oh, oh, man, what is going on? Man, we are in a high traffic time, I guess. But either way, so, Y'all, straight up, this thing has got the power you want. It's got the it's low miles for a diesel, 203. That's like nothing on a diesel, okay? Uh, I bet it's even got that plug up front where when it gets really cold, if you go up in the cold weather, you can plug it in and keep your diesel from freezing. So, yeah, all sorts of good stuff right here at the Carport Motor Company where we have good cars for good people. This is a 2003 Ram 3500, 203,000 miles, y'all. We are 18.5 plus tax tag title. You can't beat that price, baby. It's good cars, good people, and we've got a fuel tank in the back to go with it. I mean, come on, please, y'all. Somebody call us. We, this ain't gonna last long, so get on up here, all right? Oh, oh yeah, I forgot to tell you. We are paying chicken. We are paying chicken and through uh, March 31st. So come test drive a car with us, and you'll get one free chicken dinner for the driver. So you want to earn some chicken? You want to have something, something in your tummy when you come? Come on, I'll give you a free KFC dinner that you get to take with you, a little $5 meal. Boom, come on, who else is doing that around here for you? I'm paying chicken, all right? So good cars, good people. We'll see you next Tuesday. Y'all go to church on Sunday though. God bless you.